Hi, welcome to BlueFX.net. Now I'll show you how to use this lower thirds in Adobe After Effects. First of all, let's open the delivery package. Inside, you'll find another three folders. Each one of these corresponds to a different color setting. I'll use color one. Each lower thirds is three main parts, the intro, the loop, and the out. All of these are QuickTime files with an alpha channel. So to use it, you have to import these files into your After Effects project. Now let's open Adobe After Effects. Okay, here we are. As you can see, I've already imported these three QuickTime files. I will select all of them and I'll drag them to the composition icon right here. Once this dialog box appears, I'll choose the single composition option and hit OK. Now you have intro, loop, and out footage inside a single composition. The duration of this composition is 6 seconds, but you can change this depending on the duration of your final lower third composition using the composition setting options. In this case, I'll leave it the way it is for the first example. Now let's add some text to the lower third. To do that, select your text tool and click over the title area. Now just type your title. And now let's do the same for secondary text. And finally, let's add your logo to this area. I have the blue effects logo right here. And I'll drag it into the timeline. I'll make some little adjustments. And done. As you can see, the text and the logo layers extend over the intro and over the out layer. We need to keep them only over the loop layer. So let's adjust the in and out of these layers. Done. If you want, you can make a fade in and a fade out using some keyframes and the opacity parameter. Let me show you. Okay, done. Now I'll show you how to extend the duration of the loop footage. First, you need to enlarge the composition time. So open the Composition Setting dialog box, and in the duration, type 15 seconds. I will enlarge the area to see all the timeline. Now to extend the duration, just duplicate the loop layer as many times as you need. In this case, I'll make two copies. So I'll select the loop layer, and I'll open the edit menu and I'll select duplicate. Now let's move this layer forward this way. Let's make another duplicate and move it forward as well. Okay, now move the out layer to the end of the sequence and extend the text and the logo layers. Move the opacity keyframes as well. Done. I have video footage right here, which I'll drag to the composition icon, as I made before. Now inside this composition, let's place the lower third composition. Looks really good. This way you can use your lower third footage in After Effects. If you have any questions about this package, please don't hesitate to contact our support team at bluefx.net. Have a good day.